Alright guys, welcome back to some more Pixelmon! My bell's ringing. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Um, your bell is ringing. I got a bell from one of the bosses. I was gonna buy bells off people, but nobody that has tons of spare bells is yeah, on. I, I don't have to play. any. I need one of the heart, or the ho-oh uh bells. I, I have the Lugia. base. The ho -oh bells? I think that's the, like, the color of the bell is the color of the Pokemon, right? Yeah. That's the way to go about it, yeah. Okay, so, yeah, I've got a ho -oh bell. I have Lugia. Uh, what's, speaking of Lugia, what's a good nature form? It's a tanky Pokemon, so. I don't know. Tanky. Um, it's a tank, I believe it's a special attacker? Let's see. Who the Google? Best. Lugia. Nature, Lugia. Well, just type Lugia base stats. Um... From the looks of it, wow, I don't know which moveset it is, but uh, Bold is a solid one if it's a special attacker, because it takes away attack to give it some defense. Yeah, Bold is best nature. Um, I mean, yep, anything that gives it, it's got 110 base speed, so it's pretty damn fast as is. Like, you can't really go wrong with most natures on it. Neutral that, would be okay, too. That is incorrect. <laughs> Man, it has exact same uh, special attack and attack. Yeah. Like, it depends on what moveset you want on it, and you just take uh, the so best nature as the opposite side. Lugia spawns at sunset? Yep, when the sun goes mm -hmm. down, it'll be like a, maybe a little bit after the sunset, but just me oh, standing that's... there, and you're My good. Tauros's tail. I was looking at the top of the tree trying to wonder what Pokemon was up there, and it's my Tauros's tail. Let's see... You are done. I need to breed you still. Oh, Spesh got a shiny Rattata. Mm-hmm. Oh, God, that's awful. Yeah. It got a decent nature. <laughs> Too bad it's got seven attack IVs. Yeah. It's pretty trash. So, I want to get my Gen 2 decks done, but I literally can't. Yeah. You. But I need Torchex and Combuskins and Blazikins, so... Oh, you need Torchix and Buskins and, and Blaziken? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm Torchix working on it. Torchix and and Blaziken, oh my. Mm-hmm. Saw that coming. I need to find <laughs> some, because I apparently have never caught one. Get you some bowling pin Like, chicken. okay, I only have, I only have like, a few jokes here, okay? So, <laughs> I got to swing for the you? easy ones. There's a Typhlosion. That's great. Where is the Torchic? Oh. I've seen Blazikins before, I know they spawn here. Where am I? Where's my- there it is. I need to get a Zelf's hap- Man, getting a Zelf's happiness is gonna be so easy. Yeah, you just oh, but... force feed it berries and it's done. By the way, Ghost. Mm -hmm. You mentioned before a potential shiny token. What? To me. You mentioned before there was a certain special texture you were considering shiny tokening. Uh, the... Sir Doofus? Yeah. Because I'm watching it right now, better now than never, because it's I... kind of a hunt right now. I'm already flying along a river looking around for You serious. Do serious. Wait, you're actually going to turn... Oh, I didn't look to see what natures were good on it, yeah. Sir serious? Doofus yeah, get a broad show. spectrum buff, so it's at least... It's not like you're going to actually use it because it's a Bidoof, but... Yeah, go for it. Let's see, what's a good counter to resist? The trick is finding him. Like, is there a super awesome river biome that anyone has? No. Nope. Pancake. Just fly up and down any river you can find and see what happens. Usually what I do, yeah. River land spawns are one of those things that you just, like, never see when you need them. Lugia's psychic... Is it only daytime? Right? I can't stop flying to check. Flying. This. What'd you say, Gus? Is it only a daytime Bidoof, or is it nighttime, too? Uh, morning. Oh, well, that would explain why flying around has not netted me one. Yeah. That would indeed um, explain that. About how long till after dusk, or whatever? I mean, it's you're... It's again. Yeah. I can Roughly. run around. I would stay at your thing now. You have about 30 seconds before it spawns. Uh, 30 seconds to like, a minute. More like two minutes, probably. Oh, okay. But you don't want to leave it. 
I just wanted to make sure that I'm not sitting here for half the episode. Not a I'm... single Torchic. I really hope it doesn't spawn inside my house and start dying. It immediately battles you, so like... Yeah. Oh, okay. As long as you're there, it won't happen. 50? No, I've got way better than a 50, so... Boop, you're gone. Sunset. IVs number two. IVs number three. 66%. Um, no, I've got some way better ones than that. You did not inherit the correct stats. Um... 77! And you actually have decent attack. Game? Or not actually better than either of these guys. Ding, ding, ding. Although you may be... Um, well, you have all the moves. I think it might have glitched. It's oh. not 11.30 in game. No, no, the bell stopped ringing. Then you didn't place it, it, that one? No, it's glowing. No, it, it just started ringing again. It just stopped ringing. Oh, a little server lag, yeah. There's an Embor, but still no Torchic. But two fully evolved starters, and not a single thing from the Torchic line. Nice game. Nice troll. Nice troll. Hmm. <laughs> Going along through a river, looking around at, like, looking around for a Feebass. Found a Feebass. It's a boss Feebass. Yep. <laughs> and nice troll. <laughs> Like, oh, why is this green? It's a boss. See what's even greater is when that happens on a ridiculously rare Pokemon like Gerber. Yeah. Yep. Uninstall me. I was displeased. So many, many Pokemon, and right, none of them are ones see. I need. Does I got that too, by the way. Nice. So I did make a modification oh, to Celebi so that they're full daytime rather than just the morning, as well what? as whatever was the exact same spawn time as Celebi. Wait, Shaman. Shaman. What's that did... supposed to say? It's not Shadow Lugia. Uh, oh. You did the same thing to Spikey and Pichu, and both of them I got during the times they would have been regardless anyway. So, yeah. plus, like... The Celebi, it spawned during the morning, but I caught it at, like, the middle of the night in-game because ah, I battled long. it in way AFK. Ah. Oh, fuck they me. Hmm. Uh, oh, hang on. I'm typing it. That's garbage. In its entirety. Wow. Probably one of the worst losers. The only way it could have been worse is if the speed had been, uh... One of the low ones. Ghost, it it's tank not fast. Ah. It, it also has a. It's got 110 special... base speed. Okay. It's got a decreased special defense nature, Ghost. Mm. It do, whereas everything has 110 base speed. It's just like meant to be tanky. That's yeah. just an awful, awful Pokemon. Uh, it doesn't really matter anyway, because a good Lugia is defined by having multi scale and it has pressure, so. Hidden ability Lugia is like broken. No, I always want it. Good luck getting the Multi scale is the one it. that decreases super effective? No, oh, it decreases well. the first hit. Or if you're full HP, you take half damage. Oh, and then if you run like leftovers and stuff and get back to full. Leftovers, roost, protect, and stuff like that, yeah. Well, the good news is I only wanted it for. Dex, yeah. Dex, yeah. Well, I guess I'm not getting a Raikou today at all. Alright. Oh, you're hunting for one in-game and on the community day? Yeah, didn't work. <laughs> I have one. It's not I raining, don't... so I can't get a mud kip. <laughs> there goes my map to the other corner. Uh. By the way, do we have Ultra Space yeah. Open Ghost? It... No, we didn't do it. No, because we started recording before I remembered to do something like Indeed, that. Indeed, I forgot <laughs> as job. well, so we ain't doing it. God, oh boy. speaking of yep, forgetting... Your phone is laughing at me. <laughs> There. It's, it's 100 percent muted. Sorry. I just woke up a couple hours ago. Give me a break. I thought you were doing a 24 hour. Okay, BP. 
I was going 72. to until my net goes, fuck you. My net didn't come back until I woke up, which was about four hours ago. It went out at 10 o'clock. Oh. Well, I'm, yeah. That would uh, certainly interfere with your streaming ability. Okay, what Pokemon? Uh, 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 no, no, my PC! Eh. No, I stuck it at the top of a tree and then fell off the tree. Eh. There we go. I think my next goal is getting, um, Palkia, Dialga, and, um, I cannot think for. It's one of Sky's favorite Pokemon. Whatever it is. Giratina uh, is not one of his favorites. Giratina. That's the word. I don't think he ever said it's one of his favorites. He likes all the edgy ones. I really wish it would show you what the up and down is on the natures. Uh, show stats. No, the, uh, um, for the hunts. Because then you can make a decision and see, oh, okay, that's a plus special attack one. That's the one I need to get. Um, down speed up attack. Uh, not good for Milotic. I'm assuming Calm is the best one, Smash? For what? Milotic. The Feebas. Um, is it like. I don't most? have uh, the other one. If there's no good yes. natures, just go for one that's across the board. No, Calm is good. I'm running bold on mine. Calm is literally the same thing, but for special defense. Well, yours is a wall. I don't think I'd end up using it, but I always like having good IV Pokemon should I decide to start breeding. And it's a tanky Pokemon and not very offensive. You'd want a wall. I know on Poke One everyone was going for modern. So it's a opposite sure Gyarados, basically. Well, uh, quite literally, actually, because uh, it gets competitive, which is why people run modest, because it can be done offensively. It gets competitive, which means it gets intimidated by something like a Gyarados. It gets plus two special attack. It's the same thing as Defiant for special attack. And I guess an anti-intimidate ability is oh. actually not bad because it's a kind of combo. PSA for everyone. Don't use the Ender Portal inside the end. You lose yes, goes all your energy. Let's put a 20x multiplier, but that really only works on legendaries because I'm pretty sure it's the legendary multiplier. I don't know if it's like a. Well, no, it says it's one. the regular multiplier, so. No, yeah, it should be, but like. It just, it just doesn't factor one... in in the code, yeah. Yeah, I guess the other one just gives so low amounts or something like that. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it's now getting about 10 for a level 30 kill, which was more than it was given for, yeah, so it's I'm, I'm just salty really bad. That I lost all that energy because I didn't die. Yeah, and if he comes down to it, what I'll do is I'll just make a card dealer NPC that'll sell the packs eventually. I mean... They'll be pricey, but they'll be good catch-up for the card battle fight. That's the best way to do it if you actually plan on ever getting it done, because... Honestly, even without losing all my energy, man, I've gotten four packs, I think. Well, it's because you need nine different types, and some of the types are really, really rare. Oh, wow, like dragon. Really? But with and legendary steel. messages on, we should be able to, like, get yeah, some Yeah, I, I was AFK and came back, and I saw like, Rizzy on Xerneas. And, I've yeah, killed I Xerneas so messages. many Meloettos. This isn't the Savannah. Oh, no. Oh, Ghost, did you ever look in your chest? Uh, Which one, back at home? Yeah. Uh, I don't think I did. Did I kill Tim Paul? No! I was so Aww. close to the Savannah! No! Oh is, my god. Is that you? No, it's not. I wanted a Raikou. I don't know if it's I have a It's not raining? Skills. That doesn't matter. Isn't Raikou Storm? Oh, that's the Storm. Thunder is the only storm yeah. uh, Ghost, are you at a... It's usually Dawn for Forest Hill spawns. Yeah, it's not me. I'm in jungle. I'm at my uh, breeding house. Well, that's probably you then, Don. Uh, huh? Yeah, that would be on me. Some. Oh, there it is. 
Do you have one already? No. Okay. Good luck. Let's see, gotta find my Pokeballs first. That Feebash just Most suffocated annoying. itself. That Feebash just suffocated itself. Well, crap. Are you sure you want to open this bag? Oh man, I got a PC. Or not a PC, a healer. That's a good card. A Weedle. I got a Weedle. I remember back in the TCG uh, Game Boy game, the healer was uh, pretty solid. I don't know if it's What's the card do? Uh, hang on. Uh, remove all damage from all of your own Pokemon. Yeah, that but is. You gotta discard yeah. the energy. That seems reasonable to me. Yeah, because it means your opponent doesn't get any prize cards. Energy you have usually a lot well, of in like, your deck. So using that like is essentially just re like Resetting replaying your, your cards. Because if you just played the Pokemon again without any energy on them. And usually it was coupled with some mechanic for getting energy back out of the graveyard. Yeah. Like Recycle, I believe, or something like that. Probably. I don't know. The original, like, three sets of Pokemon cards was vastly different than the rest of them. Mm-hmm. I got a Professor Oak card, too. But, I mean, that was mostly because Power Creep later on made, like, 60 health Pokemon not good anymore. Yeah, 60 is nothing. Most people went out, You're like, definitely going to have to do something about the energy when it comes to that, because <laughs> you don't get them as often as you think you would. Yeah, I oh, don't know man. if you can sell individual um, cards or not. So, I got three cards with no texture on them. Yeah, that happens. Also, goes if you were to, if you were to be able to sell individual cards, it would probably crash like the printer does. Whoa! Well, These that thing had a terrible stat. It went from one hundred and four to one hundred and thirty, so it had a five. Nice. These cards might not be usable if they don't have a texture on them. I'm sure they're Their still usable. Their font is in red. I guess. Oh, these are Team oh, Rocket Corn. Zigzagoon Biome. Please. Oh, that was close. Stupid thing had, um, uh, takedown. Damn. Nice. Wow, that energy's broken. Just caught it. What, how nice. much you got, or what? Uh,. It's a full heal energy, so it's a colorless energy, so and it removes all status effects. Nice. Yeah, I forgot they had, like, powered up energy cards in that gen. Go Team Rocket booster packs? <laughs> Alright, come on, Badoof. You know you want to spawn. Don't you want it's a nice fancy clean. top pad and a monocle? Be all... You do have luxury balls, correct? Yeah, I've got 40 of them. Just checking. Yeah, no, that would have been uh, an embarrassing thing I to have happen. 31 gold ingots from the end. I have literally only carried luxury balls from day one for the sake of Sir yep. Doofus. Whoops. <laughs> Stupid thing. Ow. Not too bad, though. Not great, but... Oh, uh, that's a physical attacker. Yeah. What is? It's got a one. four attack. Yeah, it's a mix attacker. Really? Yeah, it's like a vault switch and stuff. Most of the sacred swords you can build either way. Uh, it's just not as good one way as the other, but it's still not terrible. I don't know how that works. Like this? Build that four. <laughs> Uh, uh, wow. Yeah, attack is super low, but it runs Volt Switch. Is it? It's uh, special attack is the same as its attack, isn't it? Or is You're looking that... at a different Pokemon than I am. Oh wait, 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 w
Because it doesn't get U-turn or anything, so. I caught that lightning, right? Yeah. What do we want to... I, I have no clue what I want to do for this episode, because, hey, like... Hey, we got one. It's basically going around catching... Oh, I guess I can... I'm doing dex progress. Do remain. dex progress. I, I forgot about the dex remain command. Um, where do Cyndaquil spawn? Hmm? In the savannah? Cyndaquil. Yeah, During yeah, the day. yeah. So, Arl goes to You'll see him a lot more than Toga or uh, Torchix, that's for sure. I'm so glad this guy stopped playing recently, because now I can just use his home as my teleporters now. It's amazing. <laughs> like, it's actually, like, Amazing. I just use all of his stuff. He's muted. I was yeah, kind I of hoping he was there listening. No, it's better when I trash talking behind his back. Wow. It is. Electro egg. I was going to trash talk these stupid torch eggs. You got a chicken in your savannah, ghost. Yep. Yeah, I wonder how that happened. I don't know. Blissies. I think that one might have actually been from one of my eggs. I've left it alone because it's one. If it ever multiplies, it'll get removed. Oh. Bash, I want you to what? make an army of chickens in Ghost Biome and name them all. You would kill them with an ocelot that he cheats in. I would kill would. them. An ocelot would kill them. With the ocelot that you cheat in. You're a cheater. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine cheating to name. murder innocent animals. Imagine that being the thing you cheat for. Imagine. Imagine being too lazy to slaughter 6,000 chickens. Hey, if they all have names, they all have names. Hey, wait, you're go I'm sorry, Ghost. Are you admitting laziness? Ghost I mean, it shouldn't come as a surprise. Yeah. I thought you were trash talk trying to trash talk me, but to say I wasn't the one trying to kill him. But to say, I don't know about that one, bud. I can't believe you're such a murderer. That makes me so sad. You just killed innocent chickens that did nothing at all. And what's crazy, it was the ones that you, like, for the longest time were, like, fine with not killing because they were on my mountain. But then they decided to take one trip to the stupid root forest and look at us spawned an ocelot on. No, I was rushing to get the last Bulbasaurs, and 90% of your root forest was not viable spawn because there was God forbid I chickens. put chickens in my root forest. Go make your own. Go find your own roof forest. Stupid. Aaron and I wish I had popcorn for this fight. <laughs> Ghost was trying to like capitalize on my roof forest by murdering my pets. Who does that? Ghost, obviously. Ghost. So I'm like, I'm like, to I'm like, wrap up the season with a successful Johto deck. Yeah, yeah. That's my game's frozen right now. So I hope this is going. Oh, my game is It's just you. Well, duh, it's my game being frozen. Oh. What the heck? Yeah, that's how games work. Anyway, I'm furious. Uh, ghost, <laughs> ghost. That's like going over to someone, like going over to your friend's house, and then selling their pet. Like, who does that? Ghost. Because they don't uh, want. Because, like, you don't dogs. want their Hang pet on. anymore. I don't want your dog well, anymore. Actually, I'll sell okay, it. like, especially, it's hmm. more like when like people have like really loud, obnoxious dogs or whatever in areas where they're told that they're not supposed to. No. It's like, Actually, it's like, I was it's never it's told like not to. You were just complaining about it. Crazy cat lady had so many cats that they were spreading out into the street and blocking traffic. Yeah. Okay. Guess who wasn't blocking traffic? Because it was my area. Uh, Ghost, I'm going to go over to your house and disagree with the blocks that are there and replace them. Don't mind me. He probably would like that. <laughs> if you want to replace them in the form of a, you know, temple. Actual house because you're too lazy to build one? Mm-hmm. I'm not too lazy, Trash I can. just haven't had time. Bash. <laughs> Actually, you have streamed Pixum on multiple times, you just haven't streamed on this server, yeah. Help him out by just filling his house with lava blocks. His volcano needs to erupt. Honestly, Ghost, now that I think about it, I really don't like how bamboo blocks look. I think they would look a lot better as, like, non-chiseled obsidian. Yeah? Obsidian? Yeah? Sound good to you? Or, like, dirt blocks. No, I really no. like the look of dirt blocks. Bash, chisel That's them into four different obsidians. That way, no matter what, he can't vein my. Because it goes, your your bamboo blocks are like the crazy cats, and they're getting in the way of the streets, aka my line of sight, and it hurts me. 
Larvitar. Therefore, it, uh, it must change. Yeah. I must change your home because I decide to. I'm, I'm, not, I'm never going to not there, be upset. There is, a, there is a huge difference between, like, like if they had stayed on your mountain, that would have been fine. But no, they were all over the gosh darn place. And everywhere we went, there was chickens. Yeah, everywhere you went in my area. giving me grief about killing the chickens, so, you know. Everywhere you went in my area, in my and they were underscore area. Spawns. Underscore my area, underscore. It was a public area. No, you didn't have your name on it. Hashtag it was a public area at my house. It was my no, it home. Was not, it was not within the bounds of your house. I mean... It was treated as a public area, people. Anyway. Ghost, ghost, add gold shovel claim right now. Though we never hear this garbage about, oh, it's not your home. Ah, oh, nah, give me gold shovels right now. Gold shovel. Oh, it's such a pain to add. Gold that. shovel right now. I will claim everything I, that I consider mine. Though we never hear this garbage about, oh, it wasn't <laughs> yours. It was public. 15,000 by 15,000 blocks. This just in special. I would claim cat. literally the entire ocean around my home because it's mine and people are rude. I killed the chickens from your house because I didn't like them. Mm hmm. Never have a pet, Ghost. Never have a pet. You had so many hundreds that you couldn't look in the direction of them because it lagged you. I didn't have a problem with that. You didn't have a problem with that. That is not saying that nobody did. They're mine! Why do you care? Anyway. Because it wasn't negatively affecting the server. My chickens are unbeatable. If you kill them, they come back tenfold, as Ghost saw. What happened? I spawned them tenfold. <laughs> and then he spawned tenfold. Absolutely not. He knew he never to mess with me again. I would, I'm would. i watching you know right now, I'm pretty sure, I, I'm 99% certain I threatened to, if he killed them again, move them to like tenfold, the tenfold, to a hundredfold into his home. I mean, didn't you uh, fill the house with the... Uh... No man at one point. Which the rain murdered, by the way. That wasn't even you. That was the sky. <laughs> no, you put a whole bunch of uh, chickens no, in the sky's, rain. Uh, base. Sky helped me place the snowman. He the wouldn't have killed them. Sky's base. Oh, 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 that makes sense now. I don't know about that one, bud. The I sky's base make, is technically What the made ocean. you so vindictive, but I know. I don't know what that word means. It sucks to be you. Because if I don't understand it, it doesn't work. You're... Just doesn't understand big words. What? <laughs> I know what big words means. Uh... That counts as big words. Oh, I am going for this hunt. Hmm. That is an adamant nature to hunt. Oops. Larvitar. You could have just said it. Yeah. I mean, he didn't want somebody else beating him to it, you know. He said the nature. I mean... Not too worried, either way. Not to mention the rest of the suck for, uh, for Adamant. That actually came out good. Wait, ooh, why uh, you were, uh... You picked on the draw there. I'm in the Alps, Ghost. Oh, my Charizard's not coming out. Oh, mine didn't sink anyway. Mine sink to quiet. Wow. Oh, man, it got Guts, too. That's a hidden ability, I think, on him. Uh, yes. I think so. Nope, Sandville. Oh. Guts is normal. It came out really good, those stats. Like, I would use that competitively. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. I don't agree. That's Only mine. Bad stat on mine is the speed. Special defense and HP. I mean... For a tanky Pokemon? That is special it defense defensive? is 29. What? Oh, that's Ghost. It's garbage. Yeah, mine was a hot pile of garbage. Oh, yeah, this is fine, yeah. Ghost is garbage. What did it say? That's a garbage Larvitar in general. You know, that... Came out way better than anything I've gotten recently.
My legendary box is getting quite full. My team rocket grunts everywhere. I really need to start. Tr why do you have? A why do you spawn with a lagging tail, Licky Licky? Because it usually runs Iron Ball, maybe. I have no idea. Licky Licky doesn't run anything. It's Licky Licky. Point. It's an unfortunate Pokemon that doesn't get that many stats, and it makes me sad. Ash, Wiki. Meanwhile, Tangrowth gets, like, god defense. Wiki. Tangrowth is ridiculous, because Tangle is already ridiculous. It Wiki, was a pretty Wiki. decently statted one. Wow. I just never ended up getting him very often. Ash is not kidding. You should look at the base stats for Licky Licky. Oh, poor thing. It's 85s across, you know, 85. The only thing it's good for, bad. the only thing it's good for is Wish, Protect, Toxic, Stalling, which everything else does better. Necrozma has spawned in a dead swamp biome. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. I'm Angrof guessing that's on like Ghost. Crazy stats or... speed. Definitely on me. Oh. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm in the middle of the Dang desert. It. I was literally it spawned flying... on a lava pit. Cool. I was literally flying to a... Uh... Way, uh, the roof forest to, or, or back to spawn, so I could go to the roof forest for the chance at it. I spawned literally in the middle of the night. There's no chance of a Raikou happening today. Not at all. Hmm. hmm. Easy Caught football. everything in the end. No, well, that's a Garchomp I never had. One more Garbage! That's one of what three? Ooh. Three of the crossbows I need. Three. Ouch. Yeah. That Starly came out absolute trash. Got an EV breed or hey, an Alolan Diglett. God, I haven't seen enough of those today. That was a great Necrozma. Moving on to my regularly scheduled program of looking for a Mudkip. Never mind. Um, yeah. those Dex are better in the rain. They're guaranteed. They have to be in the rain, which just ended. Dash. Oh, as I was I, saying, I, I've my been sentence. in desert in Mesa, so I haven't seen whether it was raining or not. I'm disappointed. That spawns at any time. Well then, all right. You know, Raikou happening because it's sunrise. Like spawn and Necrozma just spawned. No torch because nighttime. No mud because it stopped raining. I huh. found my first Marini in a deep ocean, finally. Like, wild. And I was like, whoa. And then they Leslie. all leave. just started spawning everywhere. And I was like, I hate you. Yeah, they're not that rare. I told you that before. Yeah, and I could not find them when I was looking for them. Like, for the That's life of me. That's usually how it goes, yeah. Whenever you want it, it just doesn't exist. And then, now that I've gotten all the Marinis I'll ever need, it's like, haha, here, have 500. What's the dope? That's a pretty good spawn spot for him. Hey, Smash, what's a good shiny water type? A good shiny water type? Most of them. Yeah, because they usually go from the, the bluish color to something more intense. Anything from purples to reds. And... I know Carvana has a really cool shiny, and so does uh, Trapedo. Two of my shiny tokens have been water types so far. Milotic and... I don't know your other one. Greninja. Ah. Uh, Greninja's shiny sprite, though, I do not like. It hurts my eyes. Can you see that a bit of a black shiny? No, no, no. I mean, it physically hurts my eyes to look at that Greninja. Well, that's the one using that pure black you were talking about, Spain. Yeah, it's like the like Vanta black or whatever the color is called. It's like, it's like actually absorbing light and stuff. It's crazy. Two fifty five, two fifty five, two fifty five. Yes. Literally, like, like maybe like two fifty four. No, yeah. if, it, if I know Pixelmon, it would be two fifty five. Probably. A bit much. They also be like a darker gray. Would be too. Dark gray. The, I I feel like they'd be too lazy to adjust it. 
Well, they they they've mentioned before they don't really care about the cosmetic side of stuff as long as they get like the features in. Yeah. Looking for Doof. Where is Badoof? There is a Badoof. I'm just gonna mind these while I'm waiting. Let's not use okay. the quick ball because that would be dumb. Un oh. I guess yeah. Because the whole goal is to get a shiny Doofing Doofington. Surfington? Du Sir Doofus. Sir Doofus the third. There you go. No, not a fastball. Nice. Not a very fast Pokemon, so. I will laugh if it catches it. Yep, indeed. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything, but then it actually synced in everything. <laughs> so. Ghost. I, How did you manage? I that was the clicked. one thing. That that you was had literally one job. That was the one time in the entirety of the series so far that you needed to not misclick, and you misclicked. That is very unfortunate, Ghost. That was like, ah, oh, that was such a ah, oh, it was such a perfect hunt. I mean, it didn't really get that many stats anyway. It went from oh. ninety-seven to one hundred eight. This egg is so Didn't good. Didn't you get the wrong nature? No, that's serious. Serious is a neutral nature, so it should have gotten a 10% across the board buff, which it did. I mean, like, the thing is, you would never use the Bidoof anyway. The IVs ain't that bad, so you, yeah. you could grab whatever. Not to mention, not to mention, it might be more beneficial to have a good nature than have good IVs anyway. I mean, not if I'm not going to use it anyway. If it never sees the light of day, it doesn't matter what it stats. Hey, I got a protector. Oh, yeah. Needed one of those. That's what you mentioned before that you need, yeah. Speaking of protector, dude, ride on in Go is ridiculously good as a ride on, not even a Rhyperior, and it's twenty five candies to evolve. It's insane. Yeah, uh, they were helping me with the Raikus. I had three of them on my squad. Like I literally don't even need to. Uh, I, I'm obviously Corals gonna are... evolve my best one to Rhyperior one day, but I just haven't needed to yet. Coros are good in Pokemon Go too. You know they're not. I get like two thousand. Uh, CP. Yeah. They're solid, but the the fact that they're normal type just means they don't really get much. Yeah, boost. they're a normal type in two thousands really low. They also have a huge variety of moves, so I keep special. getting like steel mm -hmm. and earth, uh, earthquake and like oh, other kinds units? of moves. Oh, twenty something. Yeah, about the same as Mingo's. I hit thirty today. Ah, uh, yeah, you passed me. All right. I've been playing a ton, and I've been I had like lucky eggs out the ass because of that other quest. The Jumpstart quests are really good, yeah. Yeah, there's twelve Why? lucky eggs if you finish them. I'm only like not to six mention they two. give you like two levels of experience and really. enough candies to get a Dragonite. I'm not getting yeah. and a shiny Eevee. Right I'm super hyped for that shiny Eevee. I don't know which shiny I'm gonna make it. I'm thinking it might be an Espeon. Um, I'm... uh, Espeon I think is a good site to type of tagger and go. Yeah, I, I have an Espeon. I didn't use the trick to get it, so that's one I can guarantee, because it's a walk for 10 kilometers. How'd you it. get it? I, uh, it was for the quest line. You walk for 10 kilometers with it as a buddy, and then evolve during the day, and it guarantees it. Oh, you actually, like, straight up walked it. I'm keeping this. But you have to, for the Celebi For the Celebi quest. Celebi quest. I actually haven't done a Celebi. I'm not that far in yet. I haven't gotten a Ditto, oh, I think it is. No, 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 I just got to a new one. I have to, I think... Yeah, that Ditto one held me up for the longest time because I never got any of the Ditto species native now, to my area. The Celebi one doesn't need a Ditto, I don't think. I think it needs... Uh, both Mew and Celebi, I thought. Look at all these fossils. Or maybe it's Meltan. Meltan Mew. needs one. Yeah. My current Celebi quest, I think I need to do some... I have to, like, make three friends or something. I don't know, I'm, like, on the second stage of it. I've not done much of it at all. Put your friend code in the video. Honestly, I'll do that, yeah. Although, I think within the next, like, few weeks slash months, we're getting the Jirachi quest line because they had that at GoFest. Yep. Dun, 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 dun. That was copyright. Me. Dun, that dun, wasn't me. Dun, 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 dun. That was me. <laughs> Why would they copyright you for Pokemon game music? Yeah, on a Pokemon mod. There's a lot more for them to copyright besides that. I'm going to go ahead and give my friend, too, because I'm going to need him for the quest. And I've tapped our discords. 
I'm actually no, starting no. to like walk a lot more farther away from home, so I'm able to send a lot of gifts. Like I'm gonna hit the max. Wow, no IV gain. There's nice. mine. Goodbye, friend balls. You're just gonna go thrown on the ground because I don't really want to. I'm drowning with full oxygen. Uh, my, look current, mine up. my current ripple in time is. Oh, I have to catch a Pokemon tomorrow and I have to evolve an evolved grass type. That's annoying. Because the thing is, you have to evolve an evolved grass type for this, and then the one right immediately after is evolving a Gloom or, or a Sunkern. Where is Tim Yeah, well, Chow? you can do the uh, Turtwigs and. Uh... Yeah, that's great, for... Ghost. That's great for people that can go outside and find them. I can't do yeah. that. We can... Like, I am, I think... I don't even have a Grottle yet. I think I have, like, 60-something candies for a uh, Turtwig. Potion. Like, you're, you're all talking about your Torterra? I can't. I don't have a Torterra. <laughs> Turtwig ain't that common. Is that yours, Ghost? Yep. Didn't you put yours in a video? I yeah, did. it again. Ooh, are you a good student? Add all of I mean, us. I'm sure other people are, uh, you know, ah. looking for friends for the quests as well, so I can help them complete them. Because luckily it just says make a friend, so it doesn't need, like, to increase friend level, because I hit that limit of 20 presents a day very quickly. I'm trying my best to open everyone so they can get up ranked up on friends and get the experience buffs, but it takes some time. All three of us. Go, go, go! Boom. Add me and trade me a Celebi. That would cost like a that. million dust because it's a legendary that you don't have. That's not true. It's 25% Stardust cost right now. 25% oh. less. So it costs no, 750 No, no, no. It, no, it is one-fourth. It is one-fourth mm. of normal. Yes. I, I was trading today and normally a trade is 100 and it was 75. They advertised it incorrectly then, because they said 25% of normal. Oh, yeah. Let's they see. probably meant 25% reduction. How News? rare happy, are... happy third anniversary. Where is it? I'm looking for it in the news. Jinchao's an 80 and I can't find one? What the hell? Uh... Where is it? Ah, there's a gnat on my phone. Go! Ah! Ooh. I don't know, it's one-fourth less. That's awkward wording. One-fourth less. Yeah. I mean... They should put, like, minus 25% or something. That would make more sense. Yeah. But that's the Not really that cool I thing. I love seeing, like, fans from, like, all parts of the world. Because it's like, I already have this Pokemon from this egg. But now I can trade it and get three candies. Because it's, like, so many kilometers away. Oh. Yeah. I find that a little si silly that the eggs are from wherever they came from. No, I mean, you're sending a gift. Like, you can't get the regional specific ones, so it just, it's their, you know, where they were created. Yeah, I like that. It's like that. And it's awesome because, like, oh, okay, maybe I don't need more Merrill candy or something, but if someone else, like I meet, is like, Man, I've been really trying to get these Piplups. It's like, oh, trade me a random crap Piplup. You get three candies instead of one for vending it to me. And I'll send you, you know, something from far away that you can toss into the box. Man, my eggs just won't hatch. I need to actually walk. <laughs> I don't... My phone has... Yeah, my phone has too good of Wi-Fi, so... You don't get like, drift, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I've learned over the past two days or so that, like, if you actually walk, it's really quick to hatch eggs. Oh, yeah. Like, they are not slow like, in the Like, kilometers slightest. are very, very short. Like, yes. I can do, like, I have just, like, a little route back and forth near my current place where I can walk up and down. Get, yeah. Uh, I normally um, have my phone on stops. when I'm shopping because yeah. I walk around the store so much. Do you have any, yeah, as long as you have that connected, uh, like, fitness tracker or whatever. Adventure sync? Adventure sync. Yeah. That is the term. Uh, I don't know what that is. I Basically just looks on. into your phone's, like, rumble feature pedometer thing, and uh, when you're 
when you're online, it complement or it adds the number of steps you've taken while not having the thing actually. Oh open. yeah, I have that. It yeah. doesn't work as good as I'd hope. <laughs> I mean, it it gets you something. Yeah. Unfortunately, that doesn't work for driving. No, because it if you go over a certain speed, it turns all those things off. You'll stop seeing why Pokemon yeah. spawns. It's like, it doesn't I... want you using it while driving. It's a really slow thing. It's like uh. I figured it was. I think it was like 16 kilometers an hour or something, or like 20, something like that. Luckily, the, the good news about you're that... You're over... Oh, I think it's like 11 kilometers an hour. Yeah, I was going to say, the limit's fuck all nothing, because you can trigger it by biking. Yep. Uh, yeah. The The funny thing is, Harry Potter Go is even worse when it comes to that. Like, you can't go over like 5 miles per hour. You can't even... Bike. I mean, most people don't walk that speed, so it's designed to not be done while you're driving. You're, it, it is called Pokemon Go. You are designed. It is designed to walk. Oh, I know. Like it, it actually scares me a little bit because we had a uh, one of the parks I went to today for the Raikou hunting. It was like a big loop road around the park, and the number of people that were not really paying attention to where they were driving because they were staring at their phones, checking raids to see yeah. which ones had people in it was a little disturbing. Are we talking about the bad drivers? Is that is that what we're complaining about right now? <laughs> no, I want to hey. kill some people. That's hey. not okay. <laughs> all right. Well, that's, no, that's not putting you on the good me. driver category. It, it, they're gonna kill me eventually. I am so tired of the amount of times I see people driving, not like at a stoplight, literally driving with their phone up against their face. Now, here's the yeah. thing stoplight phone usage. I that's see fine. It. Your car's not moving. Sometimes you gotta check something. It's also bad, though, because there's the. What if someone's coming, you know, not paying attention behind yeah. you and it hits you? They're gonna hit you anyway. They, they like literally, you cannot accelerate fast enough to make them not hit you. Take nits, nits. I literally am qualified to do crash scene investigation. You fucked. If you are stopped and someone's going to hit you, you're done. There's because they're go they're going do. full speed. They are going the speed limit and they are gonna hit the you. The only chance you have of being saved is if they swerve. Actually, the only chance you have of being saved is not noticing it. Because you're fucked no matter what. If they swerve, they're going to hit someone else and that person's going to hit you. Honestly, you doing something would make it only, worse, probably. Statistically, the only way to get... Uh, the best way to get out of a... You are stopped at a stop sign or stoplight and someone hits you accident is to not know what's happening. Oh, because yeah. then you don't brace and tense up. Because then. you're... Yeah, your body... When you know something's going to happen, your body tenses, it gets ready for shock... And you get hit, and then it whiplashes and pulls and everything. That but is, if you don't know what's happening, you, your you body relaxes. It just kind of flows through you. That's why uh, drunk drivers actually tend to not get injured. Yeah, well, because they are oblivious. But and the also, other side like, sees you coming relax. when you're drunk, and they're the ones who ends up getting killed in the car accidents and stuff. Yep. Yeah. Hey, Gastrodon. I'll take that By here. the way, this is obnoxious. Ghost mentioned per Park and reminded me. I learned what the... The Pokeball Great Ball Ultra Ball achievements are from today because I went to a park and it, they were they had like this uh singing festival thing and like the, it was playing the song that the achievements were from. It was weird. What? The like it's a uh, one to get ready. There's not an act. It's the other one's like two to two for the show or something. But oh that's oh the yeah. Achievements. One to get yeah. ready, two for the show, three for the money. Come on, let's go. Now go cat go. Go cat. Oh what the. Fuck? That's what the Ultra Ball one is. For some reason, they skipped the two for the money or whatever. That's or three two for, for the, the show. Two for the show. That's one. They, they skipped the two one. Um. That's the only part I actually heard, and that's at that point I just like zoned out, started thinking about Pixel Mon the entire time. Yeah. It was pretty insane. Dang. Dead Swamp. Okay, Dead Swamp. Mudkip, where are you? There's a dust skull. That's cool. Maybe Is I that a Whalmer be. that just despawned? It certainly wasn't a Kyogre, because I had gotten a message, but... <laughs> about that! Yes! About that Kyogre with the message you were talking about. Is it on you? Because I don't see it. Oh, no. wait a minute. I think I'm in the deep, deep ocean. Bo Everyone's at all times near a deep ocean. Oh. Much, so. I'm in a deep ocean. No, it's on me! Yeah, Man, you picked great timing for that that word, ghost, that sentence. Well, no, because I saw something fl like flash in the distance, and so I wanted to make sure it wasn't, you know. I think I, I think that's uh, 
like or you, Ghost, I don't know if you like played during this time. You probably did. Do you remember way back when they first added Torchic? How every time a Torchic spawned in the biome that you were in, it like appeared in your face on the screen. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It would like spawn on you and then teleport to its location. Yeah, yeah but it would spawn in front of your face, so you'd see it every time. Yeah, no, that was a hundred percent. That was uh, during Safari games because I was like, the hell was that? And every time it would jump, make me jump. Yeah. Yeah, I, th I think that is what that is. I think that's what that is. Did you see them spawn in front of you and then teleport to where it's supposed to be? Well, no, it wasn't spawning in front of me. It was way off in the distance, but it blinked out of existence. And I'm like, I thought I fixed the Pokemon size thing. Getting I'm going to go ahead and just Master Ball this because my team, I ha don't have one right now. I mean, I like my Hoopa. Anyway. You mean Master Ball on your last Pokemon. At least throw five balls. I am on my last Pokemon. Oh, I had then, two. Yeah. Like, Kyogre is a damn solid legendary. Like, it is very tank. I tanked. didn't have a... Uh... I still remember all the deaths on my Nuzlocke due to the damn things. Every trainer had one. Ooh. Well, actually, it's not an attacker, so... That's actually better for confusion? They drizzle... Yeah, you're only missing defense. Did you defense. say Kyogre's That's... not an attacker? Physical attacker. It's a special attacker. It's a special attacker, primarily. Yeah, so he has, he has a zero I... attack, so he has the a only... near-perfect one if his defense I... wasn't yeah. shit. If you had a good nature, it'd be perfect. Oh, what's his nature? Neutral. Yeah, I don't mind. It's, it's a neutral nature. It's not a decrease. The thing is, that's like neutral is never good, really. I mean, it could like, have been adamant. Yeah, I guess it like it always could have been worse. But like, there was a stat that you do not use. It would be better if that was lower and make any I mean, other stat was raised. Yeah, neutrals I think are like better than twenty five percent, but worse than seventy five percent of natures. Yeah, like like they are, yeah, they're me. They, they, they beat out the ones that lower your soup, your I best mean, attack stat. I don't have plans on using Kyogre. Kyogre is an amazing good for Pokemon. killing. Uh, yeah, oh no, bosses and stuff. I, I love. I know Choice Kyogre, Kyogre is good. Choice Star Kyogre is my favorite thing in the world, dude. I'm not a super fan of using legendaries. Like my team, if I only have Latios right now. And that's mainly because it's a flyer. And we're going to have tournaments with legendaries. And you defend for yourself there, bud. Oh, I know. I'm not saying people can't use legendaries. I'm just I'm saying if you don't use them, them you'll probably suffer. I mean, like they make yeah, a large they're... majority of Ubers. Like if you, if we have a tournament where everyone brings one Uber, and you, you have the option of Aegislash, which everyone's bringing to tournaments anyway, and Blaziken, which Ghost is bringing to a tournament anyway. <laughs> Oh, then, like, the mega it's it's not cheap. meta tournament Aegislash or uh, Blaziken, so. Yeah. I could bring it. So, so wait, you're telling me if I brought a Kyogre with like Earthquake and nothing else, I'd be allowed to bring it though? I'd be allowed to bring it? That's what we're saying? Uh, I, I don't want to say anything on that because. Uh, that's what I'm hearing. That's what I'm hearing. I'm go that's what with I'm the hearing. No. See, the, that was a trick question because it's a legendary. We don't allow legendaries, so. Like, I couldn't even bring an A's up if I wanted to. But it's soon, hopefully soon. Whenever I everyone love... gets the, their teams for this tournament ready. I always thought Shellos and Gast... Uh, Shellos, not really Gastrodon, but... Was an adorable looking Pokemon. Gastrodon is one of my, like... Top, like, 20 Pokemon of all time. It's amazing. I love Gastrodon. I like how I was Do they have good stats, or does it just look cool? Uh, really good. It's like a... they're water, like uh, water ground. You can't really go wrong with water ground. Hmm. Water ground with water type immunity. Because they have storm drain, so it's water type immunity as well. Hmm. It's so... really fun to use. I love it. And that makes some good ground types because yeah, it's not like Mudkip where it's like, well, now you're. Oh, actually, I guess none of them water grounds have weakness to ground. Fire. Or water, water, water yeah. ground are only weak to grass. Yeah, but they go from being neutral to other water types to being resistant because of the immunity. Well, immune to it. Somewhere in my mind, there was a stat benefit to doing it. And, like, you know, Storm Drain is not bad. And yeah. Chinchal is collected. And immunity is always good, no matter what. Yeah. That makes me happy. So one thing that really throws me off on Pokemon Go is, like, everything can do damage to everything. It makes sense, but they don't use the normal, like, 1x. It's, like, a quad effective is, like, 2.1 times damage and like 0. 0.6 yeah, because if they did 4x it would be absolutely like unbalanced in terms of Pokemon Go systems 
Yeah, because there's only two moves, so you can't really have coverage, so... Yeah. Dex remain. Since I got Chin Chow, Lantern's already covered. Those are baby Pokemon. Rip all of the Mudkips. I have bones. never caught a Venonat? Are you kidding me? I see why Sky bred Mudkips for his living Dex. This sucks. That's two rainy nights with no Mudkip. Oh, it has to be rain, doesn't it? Yep. I hate those requirements. I've had a marsh job last season with it. I was fine last season. The ones that are enhanced season. in rain, that's good. But ones that yeah. are requiring it, yeah, not so much. If it wasn't required, but just enhanced, sure, I'd be fine. But this just sucks. Because, for example, there are days where it'll rain all night long, but won't rain in the morning or whatever. Or vice versa. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, like, it, it's... I mean, it works, obviously. People wouldn't have gotten the sponsored car, like, without it. I just... It's not working for me. It's bad luck. Chespin. Chespin's green is so bright, I don't like it. Like, I love that color green normally, but it doesn't look right on Chespin. That's right on Chespin and me, it just doesn't look right in Pixelmon. The super bright lime green that my skin is? Chespin's a little bit darker in game. A little bit darker than that. Like, more like, shaded and dulled out. Uh, actually, no. I I'm comparing right now. That's actually my hair color. Nits. In game. I oh. agree with you saying oh. it is unnatural in Pixelmon. I, I thought, in game. In Pokemon I, video games. I thought you meant in the, the uh. No. There's no way you pulled the wiki page that fast. Like, Jespin in game is fine, but in Pixelmon it's not. It's like weird and unnatural and every single time it exists, everyone thinks it's a shiny because it's unnaturally bright. Meryl. Like, it's literally looking like a highlighter. Yeah. I think it was one of the early gen like detail models, so it's like it was probably one of the yeah, it was Gen Six, so done in a large block of other ones, so it's like eh, the color's close enough. I don't have to sit here and find the exact I mean, perfect I mean, hex. On the bright side, it, when it spawns, you'll never miss it. So yeah, you always go. Is that a shiny? All right, what can I go for on this Gen Three deck since Gen Two just ain't having it? Um, neither is Gen Three actually. Uh oh, it's already been fifty-eight minutes. Oh, your boss. Yeah, I'm trying to get on Venonat real quick because that's kind of a sad one to not have in your decks. You can swim through the water with Torchic is my hero son, so I'm gonna go for Torchic in a moment. Wow, you're incredibly slow. Does um, uh, what you call it, care about the sun, the uh, Cyndaquil? I have no idea. Um, most of the fire types do. Or at least you, they don't seem to spawn as much. It could just be, like, they're a decrease that rather than like a... That sounds like a bias ghost. What did you say? That sounds like, uh, like, observer's bias. I mean, it could be. But, like, I have a very hard time finding any fire types in the rain. Like, you'll see occasional ones, but it's not nearly the same rates. I mean, most water types have a boost in the rain, so it would make sense. Hey, it's Pyroar. Like, I wouldn't call it Observer's Bias. He's looking at the files. Yeah, but plus the uh, files well, would also, like, sometimes he's, he's... I removed some of the biases and stuff to make things that were super rare and that never spawned have a chance to spawn. So, like, our server is definitely running different statistics than the main Pixelmon one. What tier Honestly, is I find it better. Otherwise, what I wouldn't have done What tier is Nidoqueen? What do you mean? Like Third. a smoke on tier? Yeah. Probably untiered. Yeah. So bad. Because it's a highly defensive nature, whereas Nido King at least was an attacking nature, so you probably have some use on him. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Nido Queen is probably actually fine because yeah, it's Ryu. But it's like there's I, I forget they, they both get sheer force. Oh, okay. Yeah, so they both get sheer force and they get some moves to compensate for it. I love sheer force. It's so good. I wonder mm. if it's a glitch when you use it with a life orb or not. It's not. 
It, if it was the, a glitch, they would have fixed it after multiple generations. Yeah. Because no, the life orb and parts a special ability into everything. You probably would do the same no, if you put a King's Rock on. No, no, on. no, ghosts. It works to where you have to use a specific, like, if the move itself has a... Um, if the move is a boosted by sheer force, you take no life orb damage. If it's not boosted by sheer force, you do take life orb damage. Oh, right, because it's the extra effect that sheer force makes you immune to, yeah. Yeah. So it, like... I'm assuming it checks that the move is boosted first and then removes all additional effects rather than doing life orb and then doing that. Yeah. That's why I was wondering if it's a bug. If it was a bug, they would have fixed it. Yeah, with comp it being competitively useful and stuff, they probably would have... Uh... Especially with how much balancing they did in Gen 7. Like, they straight up altered Mega Evolution. I'm super looking forward to Sword and Shield, by the way. Yeah, mm -hmm. it... Like, I'm excited the fact that they're going to have at least some aspect of multiplayer. Mm -hmm. if that, and it's mad. usually a testing like. ground, so, like, if that works well, they might actually have a... You I, can bring a partner on your journey. Game. Like, I've stated this on Twitter before. I don't... Because I was asked about it. I don't care if even Tauros is removed. Like, I'll find something else I like. Well, the thing is, it's a new Pokemon game. Generally, you don't want to use the Pokemon that you've been using for the past 20 years anyway. Yeah, that's uh, exactly what I mean. Doesn't like, make it any less your favorite Pokemon, you know. It's like, it the... still exists in Pokemon. Like, Sa I, no, no, Sakurai, whoa. Masuda put out, like, a statement thing that said, like, just because they're not in this game doesn't mean they don't exist anymore. They'll be there. Like, they'll, they still exist. They're just not in this game. What is my dex? In some ways, I think we've almost gotten spoiled with having, like... Oh, we have. The no, no, no. National game... decks and everything. The the Pokemon gamers are so spoiled by the previous games get, having all the collection that it's ridiculous. Well, to be fair, I would still enjoy a game that has everything in it. I wouldn't like. I hope I that least... it's still a thing in the future. Yeah, other than the fact that they have to make money off their uh, PokeBank thing, I'd actually enjoy a game where you weren't able to port anything over from an older gen, like. But everything was available somewhere in the game. Torchic. Uh You have to remember there's like a thousand eight hundred ish, um, probably, for the next well, gen. The, it's there's already over eight hundred ghosts. It's going to be about a thousand, I think, when uh, it comes if out. you think they're gonna add hundred and fifty well, new Pokemon to a game, I'm not gonna lie. I'm hopeful, but I get People disappointed have every said generation. It. People have said that. I I don't. Know. I get disappointed every generation because like, every like, time I'm like, oh, they're gonna have 150 new Pokemon in this gen, yeah, it, it might and then not it's 80. Be, it might not be a thousand, but they're still well over there's, normal standards. There is anyway, a lot the, of Pokemon there. Like, anyway, the point and, I was making is like. Like, a lot of people are like, oh, you have to have all of these things so I can port them over. And it's like, you already have a complete collection ported over. Like, it's well, thing less is, like, fun than catching them all in the new game? I think Pokemon's going to a point where Pokemon Home is just going to be where you have to store your collection of everything. Like, because you can still all have them in one place on Pokemon Home. And if you have a living dex in Pokemon Home, you can get the Shiny Charm in any Pokemon game that comes out for the future. Really? Well, yeah, that's how Pokemon... Works. But oh, you I mean, so uh, Pokemon uh, oh, Home would pass along the info for the Shiny them. Charm. Yeah. I thought you meant that just by having them in No, you just in put Pokemon them in and then take them back out. Yeah. See, I don't... That's what I've... I, like, I don't mind that. Like, Shiny Charm's not a big thing. It's... No, it is. That's three times the Shiny Chance. That's three that's on three every out. single no, method. No, no, what I mean is it doesn't affect competitive and stuff, the Shiny Charm. Oh, well, yeah. Like, it's just a additional luck. What other people do with that, it doesn't bother me. Like, they can have the full Shiny Dex. That's a thing, sure. Why would it bother you? Exactly. But it does bother some people. That I don't understand that. I don't either, but... What are you talking about? No, I literally don't understand what you mean. What do you mean it bothers people? How it... dare other people have better chances at shinies when I don't have better chances at shinies? It bothers That's... people that the shiny charm exists? It bothers people that people could port over Pokemon and get the shiny charm almost instantly. It doesn't bo bother me. Those, po those people got the Pokemon anyway. What are you talking about? 
Why would people be upset? Like, I don't this, like, understand why. Because they had to do it the hard way because they didn't pay for all the other Pokemon games. This is the only Pokemon game they paid for, and they want to have no disadvantage. You mean they had to do it the tedious way. It's not the, the hard series. way to get the the national or like the Pokedex in Shiny Charm. Usually, is you have to sit there and uh, the GTS trade every day. So, like literally, it's so boring and tedious. I had to do that for Sun and Moon the first time. Never again. Just got I think it's garbage. Ditto. I guess that's that for Torchic spawns. But no, people complain about everything when they have a quote-unquote disadvantage. Yeah, now I if mean, it was a, you know, IV charm that, you know, guaranteed you 10% better IVs on all of your Pokemon, then they can complain. Well, like, they could straight up just make it, uh... Like, I mean, they, there's an easy fix to that, and that's that you have to be the original trainer of all your Pokemon. Well, no, because then trades wouldn't... No, then there wouldn't be version exclusives. Mm. And they wouldn't be able to sell two copies so that you could trade with your friends, but really you don't have any friends, so you buy two copies and you trade with yourself, and then you buy two oh, systems oh. because you have to use something to put the cartridge in. And... Oh, I had I, a like... bug on my monitor, and it looked like a Pokemon in the distance. I'm like, what the hell Pokemon is that? Although, I think you are uh, not too far off there, Ghost. I think an IV charm or something like that, at least, will be a thing one day. I mean, they already have bottle caps. Because, like, they're really trying to make the... Actually, never mind, you're right, that's, that's, that is the thing. But, because they are trying to make the game easier. Like, Pokemon easier to, like, get into competitively. Yeah. Because they want people to do it. Although, I'm just hoping, like I said, there is a game, what, like, still in the future where every Pokemon's in there. But at the same time, like, they... The first, or potentially even first and second, like, games on every single new system will just not have new every Pokemon in it. They can't do it. Well, they, if, if there's not a significant graphical update, if they oh. just port over all the old models and animations and don't have to it, change them and create Then no one will be happy, though. Yeah, no, people are already complaining about the graphics of this. Yeah, people won't be happy if they do that. They want the secret new graphics and new systems because, quite frankly, since, like, since the uh, pixel art, the games are all gone now. People can't. They, they, there's not new sprites every game. They have to just hope for better quality models every game. And yeah, the fair biggest, enough, yeah. The biggest issue is look at any sort of RPG or something. You'll see they reuse models, and the big reason in behind that is it's cheaper labor costs, and they also well, yeah. When you just have to pilot off. swap, and you're like, oh. This is the purple wolf, which means it's more dangerous than the green wolves that you saw back two areas ago. Well, yeah, but they did that because models take up a lot of room on yeah, them. Yeah, and a pallet takes up, like, a couple bites and bits and stuff to cover, you know. Exactly, and it, so Pokemon, every single Pokemon is a different model. They yeah, don't and reuse, the, each one of those has an animation and an idol and a walk and, yeah. What did you say about Nidoran? Well, Nidoran male and female are basically the same thing. Not even close. Pull two out of your PC right they now. They probably they have, have the, the same, same skeleton, but that's as far as modeling they can get. No, like, Nidoran male's wider and everything. It's a lot different. But, uh... I just meant that's the closest to reused models you're gonna get. That's not true. Plus one mining. Well, I guess, yeah. Those things are literally the same. Actually, those probably are the same model. No, the Except for, like, different. the plus and minus on the tail, yeah. Yeah. But, um... It was probably an easy day for the, uh, pick someone person who oh, created those ones. You. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Take Pikachu, change it a little bit. Palette swap, there you go. <laughs> I'd probably want to start it with Pichu rather than Pikachu. Then you don't yeah, have to make it less fat. Ears. It's still a... one of the many Pikachu clones. Yep, there's always one in every generation, and none of them have sold nearly as many plushies as Pikachu. I can't wait to see Oh, apparently there's still, one. like, from what I've heard, they're more accepted in Japan. Like, they've got more of a fandom in Japan, it's just, over here, one's like, rip off and doesn't want to like them. Oh, rip off, doesn't evolve, useless stats, why the hell do we want it? Yeah. Like, some I, of them I think yeah. are actually really cute, I like the Dene. They they have good designs usually, cute? but they're usually pretty mediocre in terms of Isn't stats. Like goes to Toga Tomorrow, a lot like Pikachu too. Uh, Toga Tomorrow. It's one a Pikachu of clone. If Pikachu that's what you clones. mean. Yeah. It's an electric Every game has one, Yeah. 
If it has the cheek pouches and the same eyes like that, or all like the eyes are not the same. But if it has like the cheek pouches like that, it's a Pikachu clone. There's the Dene, Togedomaru. One of my favorites. Amoko was my favorite. I wish they would have expanded on. They don't expand on Pikachu clones. I know. I'm just saying. Actually, yeah, none more... of them evolve, like, at all, ever. The closest to expanding on them is Plusle and Minin existing. Well, and Pichu. Well, Pichu, that was, like, the, that, is that is Pikachu. the only, like, that's the Gen 2 Pikachu clone, but that's because it's Pichu. Like, it's weird. That one's, like, <laughs> Gen 2 technically didn't have a Pikachu clone, it had a Pikachu counterpart, like, a baby form. Yeah. What does, uh... Um... What is its name? What? Describe it. Oh, I don't remember what I was even saying anymore. My brain... My ADHD kicked in. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, something shiny. But it's not really I, an actual shiny. That was literally what happened, basically. Well, except it wasn't my brain going a shiny Pokemon. Jeez. <laughs> Oh, is anyone uh, I, currently doing any hunts I, or something? Yeah, nah, I was about I'm to chilling. say it's probably a good time to call it. Yep, because I got some hunts done. Uh, I'm filled out some more of my decks. Like, good progress this episode. I'm just Same. waiting on my breeding to actually produce something worthy of being titled, you know, tournament let ready. We had, what, th four legendaries this episode? I, I didn't see two. a single one of them. It was all on you and Dawn today. Uh, Smash got one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because you got another Necrozma for uh, yeah, Necrozma. his collection. And Dawn got Cobalion, yeah. I got Kyogre, and uh, my Lugia. So I was screwed. Haha, mm -hmm. uh -huh. how does it make you feel, Mr. I got a shiny Raikou today? I yeah, find it I, funny. I, I, I'm kind of satisfied with the shiny Raikou and the shiny uh, Alolan Executor. Yeah, I'm mad about the Alolan Executor because I think that's one of the normal like one in four fifty or whatever. No, no, they're all the all the Alolans are boosted when you find them on the outside. Oh, okay. So that that so I, I wasn't. I think they're like that. one in fifty rate for the event, and then they'll go oh. back to the one in four hundred or whatever. I was having so many Alolan Geodudes. I really want a Alolan Geodude, like a really good Alolan. Yeah, the Alolan like, Geodude, the Diglett might be interesting to have, but well, I just want the Geodude because Alolan Golem is like one of the I guess, the best Lush type attacker in the game, or one of the best. Um. Uh. Jolteon caps at around twenty hunt or two thousand ish. I, yeah, I think the golden would probably go to twenty five ish. Twenty five hundred. That's it. A lot of Pokemon don't really get beyond. Like their caps are very hard. Like that's some of trash. them are just absolutely useless. Like today, I was like, oh, you know, I'm, I've got to take the picture every, once a day to get the Pikachu with the party hat, and you get one a day all the way to the sixth. I have like fifteen that. of those from last year. I don't need more. Yeah. See, I don't have any of them. So I'm like, ooh, I want one for Pichu, because from an egg, I want a Pikachu, and I want a Raichu, at least. But okay, then I was no. like, I'm going to catch, I'm going to go for Smeargle. So I take a whole bunch of pictures of my Pokemon, and it's like, well, I took 300 pictures, and none of them went to Smeargle. And I'm like, well, maybe I should optimize my move set. And I'm like, oh, Smeargle's top CP is like 450. Uh, as a note goes, so Lolan Golem has a max CP of, of 3,000. Yeah, so that would actually probably be, like, other than, like, Zapdos and Raikou, I don't think anything else would even come close. <laughs> Alright, um... Anyway, yeah, let's yeah. wrap up. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, subscribe for more, ding that little bell to make sure you don't miss notifications of new episodes, and we'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye. Bye, guys.